This is Will with High Voltage here with Hale from The Magicians. So, new season, and now you get to be the bad guy. Yeah. Uh, so, as an actor, what were your reactions when you first read that in the script? I was pretty stoked. I was really, really happy and excited. Um, I've wanted to be a supervillain for most of my life, so this is a, a little bit of a of like a bucket list moment. You definitely um, got the supervillain voice, I feel. Hey, thanks, I guess. <laughs> it's uh, a compliment. Uh, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, thanks. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm excited. I also, it's, a, it's an opportunity for me to, to do something completely different that people haven't seen before on the show and or have seen of me. Um, so it's nice as an actor to be able to change it up on the series that I've been on for the last three years. So it's, it's pretty cool. And I imagine that if we ever get Elliot back, he will probably have grown or changed or learned something along the way and he'll evolve as well. So he tends to, to evolve every once in a while. He's evolved quite a bit, especially yeah, right. with all it's everything that's happened in Fillory, all that uh, responsibility that that's was right. that's put right. on his shoulders. It was heaped upon him, yeah. He was sort of uh, in a hard place about that for a long time. That was a, that was a great character arc. Uh, I hope we get him back at some point. I do too. To be honest, um, I, we're, we're on episode four and so far nothing, so... I've heard. I do. So we've got no no hints of Elliot back. Yeah, are there hints Elliot. of the other characters who lost their uh, pasts? I feel like that is an easier solution. Um, at some point, probably the rest of the characters might come back, but but Elliot is sort of up for grabs at this point. I don't know. 